A disabled woman who was about to turn 60 was killed in a drive-by shooting in Compton. Her mother spoke about her devastating loss with our Amanda Starantino. I got up and I went to the car where she was and I tried to wake her up and she was already gone. Rosie Wilkins lived through something no mother should have to endure. I couldn't believe it. Her daughter Beverly Wilkins killed in what investigators believe was a drive-by shooting here on the 700 block of South Holly Street. Well, the windows wasn't shot out. It was shot through the trunk part and it was like maybe three bullet holes in the trunk. So I didn't understand how she got shot and he, I, I don't, I'm not going to speculate. I don't know. Beverly was with her boyfriend in his Hyundai SUV just before 11 p.m. Monday night. I thought it was fireworks. That's where I fell, the gunshot. So I felt some hit my back. Her mother says her 59 year old daughter was disabled and had been living with her for years. You be around somebody all your life, you know, and then all of a sudden they gone, not with sickness, but carelessness, you know. That's not good. Investigators say Beverly was shot three times and the suspect vehicle drove away immediately. There is no vehicle or suspect description. Please turn yourself in. Whoever you is, turn yourself in, you know because there's nothing good gonna happen to you. You take a life, somebody gonna take yours. That's the way I feel. With no answers as to why this happened, Beverly leaves behind her mother, a sister, and her 40-year-old son. It's hard to lose somebody you know that close to you. In Compton, Amanda Starantino, KCAL News.